Hi, in this video, we are going to learn how to add teachers, classes, sections, subjects, and we are going to understand how to configure the teacher. So this is what I'm going to take in this particular video. So the first thing that I'm going to do is go back to the dashboard and I'm going to show you from there. Okay, so this is the dashboard and as you can see, you need to, the, you need to follow the seven steps to create your school timetable. Step one is you need to add teachers, then the classes, then the sections and then the subjects. And then we need to configure the teachers. Okay, so these are the things that I'm going to cover in this particular video. So first thing that you need to do is click on add teachers. Once you click on to that, you're going to come to this particular screen and all the options that we had in the dashboard you can see it out here that is adding the teachers subjects classes and the sections so you can select it from here itself okay so this is the screen where we are going to add the names of the teachers so the first name i'm going to take is ajay so you just need to type in over here and click on add and you can see that particular entry is over here okay i'm going to take one more name maybe vijay and click on add and you can see how fast we can actually do this okay then maybe nitin i'll take some random names maybe abhay i will take uh, mukesh okay so these are the names we have around five names i will take a uh, name like aditya and i will take the name that is abhi shake okay so these are the names that i have added so these are just the random names okay so you can see we have added around seven teachers and uh, after adding the teachers maybe you felt okay maybe that name is uh, something else so abhi shake so i will simply click on the edit option and you can change that name whatever you feel like or I'll just make this as a B-shape too, just to show you that we can make the changes. Click on submit and you can see that difference out here. That is a B-shape too. So this is how you can edit every name of the teacher. Similarly, if you feel like, okay, maybe a B-shape, that wasn't the name that you wanted or you just don't want that name. So simply, you know, tick over here on the checkbox and click on delete and that particular name will be uh, deleted as you can see now what i'm going to do one thing i'm going to again add the name of his shake and click on add and for some reason you just don't want any name you can just click on select all and click on delete and that will basically delete all the names okay so this is how you're going to add teachers now for adding the subjects you will already have some subjects added if you feel that you don't require any subjects any of the subjects you can simply uh, you know tick over here and click on delete and that particular subject will be deleted if you don't want them similarly you can edit the subjects and if you want to add something new you can simply type in and click on add and that particular subject will be added similarly you can do the same thing it's like very similar screens we have okay so over here this is for this is for the classes basically you will have around uh, you know class 1 to class 12 i have some around uh, four classes out here if you require any other class other than the two classes you can just simply type the name of the class and click on add if you want to delete all the functionality is absolutely the same so this is how you will be adding the classes and then we have these sections one class can have many sections so class 1a 1b 1c d so all those sections will be storing over here okay so this is how you're going to do the basic data entry and then after you just you know do all this you are basically going to configure the teacher so we need to configure every teacher configuring the teacher basically means we are going to assign subjects to the teacher so over there for that okay we have the option that is configure teacher slash class and you can see that is the first option that is configure teachers and this is the screen that you will be 
coming across and over here you can see the teachers maybe the same teachers that we had okay just now we did the data entry so we have abhay and uh, abhay basically takes computer okay and click on add and uh, there is a possibility that abhay also takes maybe gk so i click on add so you can see abhay takes computer and abhay also takes gk so then i click on abhishek and for abhishek i will give uh, maybe you know maybe english right just randomly i'm selecting this and you can see the entries out here then for aditya maybe aditya takes uh, maths and then i will take for ajay ajay i'm going to give it maybe hindi and uh, then mukesh i'm going to select maybe the sst and you can see the entries out here getting stored then for nitin i'm going to okay i'm going to take french and uh, lastly vijay any subject that is left out okay let me just check uh hindi is there gk is there okay uh, we don't have uh, okay i'll just take arts okay okay so these are the teachers and their respective subjects and you can add multiple subjects just like what i did for abhay abhay takes a gk and abhay also takes a computer so similarly if you want to add something select and click on add i mean if you want to delete something select it and delete it so this is how we need to do you know we need to configure every teacher so i've taken two things into this so that's it in this video in the next video we will meet bye for now